Good evening, everybody. Yes, I'm wearing a blanket today because I'm cold, even though it's sunny outside, but I've been sitting in a chair all day, so I'm cold. Tonight we are reading The Dinosaurs Are Having a Party. Things we all like, dinosaurs, parties. A little bit of British humor. All right. <clears throat> the dinosaurs are having a party. It starts precisely at three, but I'm a boy, not a dinosaur. So I'm, I'm pleased they've invited me. Look at that, he's putting on his bow tie. The dinosaurs are having a party. It isn't too far on the bus. The house is vibrating and shaking, but the neighbors aren't making a fuss. A big dinosaur appears by the door. He smiles and says, hello. There are plenty of meat eaters in here. Are you sure you want to go? Here's what the note says. Dear special guest, you are invited to B, crossed out B, dinner at the dinosaur's party at 3 p.m. on Saturday. Yours, Mr. T-Rex. The dinosaurs are having a party. Some are extremely tall. Others inside are terribly wide, so I squeeze my way through the hall. Stepping inside one of the rooms, there's a game of musical chairs. A little one loses and wails, not fair, nobody cares. So they change instead to musical bumps. The music suddenly stops. The little one looks like he's winning till he's squished by a triceratops. The dinosaurs are having a party. There's plenty of food to gobble. There are jellos of every flavor, though something is making them wobble. Those are big jellos. There's a barbecue in the back garden, though I can't see a morsel of meat. The cook suggests I sit down, but I don't like the look of this seat. It's a grill. The bouncy castle is lots of fun for the whole of the dinosaur gang until a huge stegosaur jumps on and bursts the whole thing with a bang. Get it? Because stegosauruses, they got the spikes. There's a really long line for the toilet. Someone is being too slow. One desperate dinosaur is shouting, hurry up, we all need to go. Someone is flushing the toilet. Then slowly pushing the door, a terrible stink spills out. Then T-Rex steps out with a roar. I go to grab a party bag. I've had such a lot of fun, but T-Rex spots me sneaking out. So I break into a run. I run and run and run some more. I only just catch the bus. The driver shouts, hold tight, everyone. The T-Rex is after us. The driver turns left, then right, then left, trying his best to confuse him. He goes round and round in circles. Hurrah, we finally lose him. I mostly enjoy the dinosaur's party. There is just one little snag. I don't think the bag I picked up was really a party bag. It's a dinosaur egg. Crazy, twists and turns. Thanks for reading tonight. Have a good one.